So in my existing bathroom, I have this grab handle, which is vacuum based and as you can see, it has come off. So every couple of days it comes off, so I'm not happy with it. I'm going to remove it. And instead of this, I'm now going to install a permanent handle. So instead of those uh, suction cup safety bars, I'm going to install this one, the stainless steel one and it will be installed somewhere around here. Now, the only thing is this bar is 18 inches in length and the studs are normally 16 inches apart. So if uh, one stud is here, it will be approximately 16 inches. But for this one to be installed in studs, I have to incline it like this. So the first step is that I'm going to find where these studs are and then the rest of the installation will proceed. I use this magnetic stud finder and just by rubbing it on the wall, wherever there is a screw, it will here, as you can see. So there is a screw, uh, sorry, there is a nail here, which is uh, indicating that the stud is here. So I'll put a mark with a pencil around here and around here. And then I'm going to find where the other stud is. Most likely the other stud is going to be somewhere around here. Somewhere around here, so let's see. This, this is where the second stud is. I put a mark here and then draw a straight line further down on these tiles to see where the studs are and then accordingly drill the holes. So in doing this job, there are a couple of concerns. Number one, finding where the stud is behind the wall and finding its center point. The reason is this grab handle has the screws uh, around it located in a way that you have to make sure one is in the center and at least one is close to the center so that you have at least two screws holding in uh, the grab handle. Another concern is if you find the stud, you have to make sure that the location is such that there is uh, no existing nail or screw in the stud. Because if you start drilling holes, you will end up right on top of the screw or the nail which is already there. And uh, last but not the least, drilling in the tile is always a little bit challenging. You don't want to crack the drill even with the right drill the bit. masonry drill bits that i am using are these i have used them for a few other projects also for drilling into tile and they have worked wonderfully well for this particular project i use the 3 16th one so after taking several careful measurements and ensuring that i have located the center of the stud and there is no nail existing behind it and using the masonry bit to drill. Now using a wood bit and drilling a hole in the stud to make sure that it doesn't split when the screw is inserted. Now partially screwing in the screw in the pilot hole. Now starting the installation from the top side first and similarly we'll repeat all that procedure on the right hand side. This is how I have installed it basically with two screws almost centered with the stud. I'm, I'm not sure if I can get a third screw in there. It might be on the edge but since it is pretty sturdy I'm going to leave it as such and now I'm going to install these covers and the job will be done. So these are the slotted edges. One will go here, one will go here and the third one will go here. All I need to do is line it up like this and there it goes. Similarly for the and this is how it looks in the end. Pretty sturdy. Thanks for watching.